Hey, what's up guys, Malik is here. In today's tutorial, I will show you how to composite green screen inside of DaVinci Resolver. So let's get started. First of all, let's start with creating a new fusion clip. Go to the fusion tab and let's arrange our nodes by right clicking arrange tools to grid. Now let's change the media in name to green screen. And let's create after that a planner tracker, shift space and search for planner tracker. Change the viewing mode into just one window and let's create a mask around the edges of the green screen like this. After that, click on track forward. And you can see that the tracking is going very well so far and the tracker is doing a great job. After that, we're gonna create a delta keyer node to, ke to key out the green uh, in this video. So, shift space, delta keyer, and you can just go to the background color here, click on pick screen color, and select the green, click OK, and this is it. Or just you can use the icon here to select the green. After that, change the viewing mode into uh, status, go to the third tab and make some changes to the threshold until we get rid of this gray area. And uh, let's increase the clean, let's clean the background and this looks good. Go back to the final result and after that we're going to add our second video which is going to replace this screen. So go to the media pool import our video here and after that go to the planner tracker click on create planner transform connect our footage to the planner transform and then connect the planner transform to the delta keyer with the merge node after that we're gonna change the size of this video so go back to the media in one shift space transform node let's decrease the size like this maybe change the angle a little bit and now in order to send this video to the background go to the merge node Control T and this will invert the foreground and background so this is our result so far we still have one small problem which is this white markers now in order to get rid of these white markers let's create polygon node okay let's create a polygon node create another planner transform and now connect this polygon node to the uh, to the yellow input here after that we're gonna need another transform node and connect the output of the planner transform 2 to the masking input of the transform 2 after that we can get rid of this planner tracker one and select all of these three nodes shift and drag them to connect them here now let's display the transform two to our monitor go to the polygon and let's draw a mask around our screen like this now if we go to the transform two and uh, decrease the size you can see that we are decreasing the size of the whole video but inside this mask and we want to do the opposite so we just increase the size until we get rid of these white markers like this now if we go back to our final result uh, we can clearly see that we got rid of the white markers and this is our final result So if you guys like this video, make sure to subscribe for more videos and I will see you in the next one.